if you're a regular viewer of my videos, you know that when I have to type a test phrase, I'm partial to hello, you rummy buzzard. Why would that be? I've used that phrase in quite a few videos over the years. Let's list that and run that. There we go. Hello, you rummy buzzard. I'll redirect that over to device T1. And it should come over over here. And sure enough, it did. And what am I going to say to root? I'm going to say, hello, you rummy buzzard. Oops, if I can spell buzzard. And that's it. And if I run it, it just kind of scrolls up off the screen. It's, I'd say, most enhanced or native mode. So, And figured it was time for me to share exactly how I came across this phrase and why I use it. And the reason I use it is because it is steeped in a little bit of Tandy lore. It turns out that that phrase made it onto uh, some distribution Tristos 1.3 discs early in Tristos 1.3's lifetime. And Tristos 1.3 being for the Model 3, of course. And there are a couple of different stories as to how it ended up on the distribution master diskettes. Um, turns out it was a test phrase used by a Tandy employee. So basically what happened was when the Tristos 1.3 uh, master was created, the disc that had been used to create the master had been used for some testing in the past, and the phrase, hello you rummy buzzard, had ended up on some of the sectors. Early versions of Tristos 1.3 had a bug where whenever it wrote anything to disk, uh, it would append another sector to the end of the file. Now, for the most part, uh, Tristos 1.3 got patched and files were fixed, but one file was missed, and that was hertz 50 slash bld. So if I list that file for you now, comes the file, and as you can see here, the last sector that got appended to the file contained the phrase, hello you rummy buzzard. In fact, it actually contained it multiple times if you saw it scroll by, it threw by pretty quickly. And if I list the file for it with ASCII, there we go. And we see Joe, it almost looks like Joe colon three, like someone named Joe had a file on drive three. But either way, uh, hello you rummy buzzard. So how did this come to Tandy's attention that it got out? I'll include links in the video description uh, to the Usenet posts where some of the folks that worked at Tandy either were familiar with it, or in the case of one of the folks that responded to a thread now from about 20 years ago, I actually worked on the case when a customer called up very angry. And the story there is a California pizza shop owner who happened to be British, had a Model 3, and claimed that when the machine, he was using a machine, it would crash and go double size and print the words, hello you rummy buzzard. And when it did, he wrote a letter to John Roach. And I believe the, the letter had something along the lines of, you can call me a son of a bitch to my face, but I'd like to know why my computer is cursing at me. Um, so that ended up down at tech support, and uh, one of the folks that replied on Usenet was the person that handled the case, called up the guy. Turned out to be a real nice guy, according to the, you know, the post. And they figured out that his machine had a problem with bad RAM, um, the early memory chips they were using apparently couldn't handle some of the tighter timing required. And that would cause the machine to crash and do random things, which caused it to predictably load Hello You Rummy Buzzard from someplace on disk and display it on the screen. So either way, that's kind of the little bit of lore there. Uh, apparently, according to them, that on the original masters before they left Tandy Q&A, there were a lot of other cool phrases on there. Um, and I believe that they got this person to change her test phrase to the quick brown, brown fox jumps over the lazy dog one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero times. I always wanted to share this. This is just one of those things that was a story told on Usenet, and I finally was able to verify it. Thank you, Ira, for the disk image so I could demonstrate this. So for those of you that wonder where Hello You Rummy Buzzard came from and why I use it as my test phrase, that's why I use it because it's shrouded in a little bit of um, fun Tandy lore. Until next time, thank you for watching. This will mark the end of Septandy for everyone, I think. It's the 28th when I filmed this. So happy Septandy, and until next year, when we do it all again, there will be even more videos on this Model 4 and all of my other machines. So thank you for watching.